Suspect identified in Young Dolph's murder. Investigators offer a $15,000 reward. Rowdy Nation TV, welcome back to the channel. Do me a favor, guys, before we jump into this story. Click that like button, subscribe to the channel. Let's get it. The internet is reporting that a reward is being offered for information leading to the arrest of a Memphis man wanted for the murder of Young Dolph. I made a video, an earlier video, about Young Dolph getting shot and killed in Memphis uh, back in November, and I said in that video that this case will get solved. And as you can see, uh, here we are in January, a couple months later, and they have identified one of the suspects. Now, a warrant for first-degree murder has been issued for a 23-year-old Justin Johnson, who is allegedly to have shot Young Dolph on November 17, 2021, in Memphis. Law enforcement agencies are offering a combined reward of $15,000. Johnson has been added to the TBI's most wanted list. Johnson also has an outstanding warrant for violation of federal supervised release. The original charge was for a weapons offense. So this young brother is known for carrying weapons, right? Johnson is 5'8 and he weighs 190 pounds. He has a name Jaya tattooed on his right arm. The U.S. Marshals service says that Johnson has ties to organized criminal gangs and should be considered armed and dangerous. Like I said before, I knew that this case was going to, uh, the family, Young Dolph's family is going to, eventually they're going to get some justice. I, I hope, I pray that they do. Now this young brother was only 23 years old, right? And uh, not really a factor. I don't even know who he is. And what I, if, if you're like me, if you guys are like me, I'm wondering what kind of ties um, that Young Dolph had to this kid right here. You know what I mean? Is it some kind of gang? Is this some gang, some gang street stuff, or is this, or is, or is it, you know, behind some of the rappers that Young Dolph had beef with in the industry? Because you know, in his city, you know, there's a couple rappers. I'm not gonna name their names right now, but if you watch my other video, I think I named them in that one. There's a couple rappers in his city that he got beef with, right? Now we don't know nowadays. You know, when you had beef when I was coming up, it was rap beef. You know, they kept it on wax. But nowadays, you know, this stuff spills into the streets and people's entourages get into it. Shots get fired. People get killed. And it's just uh, an ongoing, continuing thing. And it seems now I, uh, they finally got the, the top dog when it comes to uh, Young Dolph. And I thought it was very, very sad, man, you know, because, you know, I like Young Dolph. You know, I didn't listen to a lot of his music, but I did listen to some of it, some of it. And I liked him. And it seemed like he was coming up. I liked him because he basically he was like a uh, independent artist. He got it out the dirt. You know, he didn't get no major label, you know, to, to back him when he came up. He got it straight from the dirt. So, you know, all that money. That's how he got, you know, a lot of these kids, man, that come up nowadays, these rappers, you, I don't even hear them. When I hear about them, they be rich. I'm talking about I never heard a record in my life. And I see them and they got, I'm not sure if it's costume jewelry or whatever it is, but they got the bling, they got the cars. I'm not sure if they rent these cars, because a lot of times they do that. A lot of that stuff be fake. But then again, a lot of that stuff, you know, these kids are coming up pretty fast. You know what I'm saying? But like I said, you know, they, they uh, uh, Justin Johnson, you see the picture right here, Justin Johnson, 23 years old, wanted for murder. You know, they said if anybody got information, you know, y'all might want to call Memphis or whatever. I hope his case gets solved. I really do. You know what I'm saying? I hope that brother's case gets solved. But, I, you know, it was just too messy the way they did it. In the middle of the day. You know, you letting out shots, two people jumping off with um, high-powered uh, high powered weapons, uh, semi, uh, you know, I'm not sure what kind of, they look like an AK, an AK-47 or, or AR-15 or whatever kind, whatever kind of gun that is. It's not a regular handgun, right? And it shoots multiple, multiple rounds of bullets. And you just fire that off in the middle of the day in a cookie shop. Anybody could have been in there, right? So, like I said before, they're looking for this young man, Justin Johnson. And once again, I like to say RIP to Young Dolph. My condolences go out to him and his family, his wife and his kids. You know what I'm saying? Hopefully they can get some justice. Roddy Nation TV, click that like button, subscribe to the channel, rock with your boy. We out.